First question will be from Maddie. What's up, Dawson? How are you doing? Good. How about you, Mad Lab? Doing good. So Josh Allen is now the first person in NFL history to throw for over 100 touchdowns and rushing for 20 in his first four seasons. And the Pro Football Hall of Fame was like, hey, we need your jersey and your cleats. So we're sending them to the Pro, Pro Football Hall of Fame. Is this like not a big deal to you or is it just weird or unique to be able to play with a player who has broken so many records already? Well, first of all, it is insane. I mean, it's incredible. You know, he's sending his jersey and cleats to the Hall of Fame already in year four. Um, but at the same time, it's just not surprising. I mean, we've been with this dude for a long time. Now it's my third season with them. We've seen him make freak all-star, you know, all-pro plays every Sunday. Um, so it's gotten to the point where it's just normal to us. But at the same time, you got to realize this dude is unbelievable. It's so fun playing with a guy like that. I think Emmanuel talked about it earlier this year. Like, he's a fan of Josh. Like, so am I. Like, so is the whole team. You know, we sit back and watch him make plays. And we're just like, I mean, it looks like he's playing a video game out there. But um, it's just Josh Allen doing Josh Allen things, you know. It's, it's fun I to watch. It. I love it. Thanks, Dawson. Happy New Year. For sure. Happy New Year. Hey, Dawson. Heather Prusak here. Um, no need to see my face right now. Um, <laughs> just want to ask him about seeing Lee Smith uh, this weekend and, you know, just what that's going to be like. And maybe if you could just kind of reflect on, you know, what he meant to, you know, that early portion of your career and how he helped you out like that. Yeah, I was super excited to see Lee. Um, I think his family's coming with him too, which will be awesome. Uh, but, you know, he, he was such an integral part to my development too, just whether it was on the field stuff or off the field. Um, just showed me the right routine from day one, you know, how to talk to coaches, how to, you know, talk with Josh and be in his, you know, corner and asking him where he sees me in the progression on different routes, uh, the right steps to take against different, techniques of defensive ends and linebackers um he was you know just as important as anybody else in that building for my first year or so um and you know I view him like a big brother he's he's a dude that I'll stay in touch with for the rest of my life um you know I've seen him every off season even this last year even though he's not even on the team anymore but um it, it's going to be fun to see him we're going to do a little jersey swap after the game and everything um so he's he was very, very important to the first couple of seasons I had here. Awesome. Thanks, Dawson. Happy New Year. Sure. Happy New Year. Hey, Dawson. Good to see you. How you doing? What's up, Dante? Good. Good. With all the adversity that Emmanuel Sanders has had to overcome in the past month, as a teammate, what does it mean to you to see him still work hard every day and contribute to this team? Yeah, I mean, he's just – he's the, like – perfect example on how to handle yourself on and off the field after, I mean, I don't even know what year this is from 12, 13, something crazy. Um, you know, to, to be in the position that he is where he's still making incredible plays, but then having to deal with some adversity, little injuries here and there um, just goes to show you that's a true professional. Like there's a reason he's still so successful at this age because he does everything right off the field in the training room, working out wise in practice, He'll outwork everybody else, um, even at his, you know, status as a veteran. So it, it's very impressive to watch a guy like that run around and do everything so correctly. Um, and he's a perfect role model that everyone should want to model themselves and model their game after. Because um, even when, you know, an injury or something little comes up, a little bump in the road, he's, you know, right there in the training room the next day, ready to get back right, get back on the field as fast as he can. Um, so it's, it's, it's pretty incredible having a teammate, a teammate and leader like that. Definitely. Well, thank you. And, uh, yeah. happy new year. sure. Happy new year. That's all we have for today. Thanks, Dawson. Wait, I love the Shrew Farms poster, by the way. Oh, and the WandaVision. Got some good stuff. See y'all. Yeah.